This is Lisa, and I'm going to show you where I'm going to go together today for my lunch in my office. It's going to be pretty easy. It's going to be mahi mahi, uh, multi grain rice, and some broccoli. Okay, so today I'm going to do a little bit of mahi mahi. I just cut a little fillet in half, and I'm going to use the Vitacost multi grain rice blend and half a package of frozen broccoli broccoli cuts but to start I'm going to use my rice let's see if I can do this one-handed maybe not so I'm going to use two of my little cups of the flavor of the multi-grain rice and let's see if I can pour this go for a Mexican flavor. I'm going to use these little flavoring packets. Season my rice a little bit. And sorry, but I don't measure. And let's see. I'm going to use half a package of the frozen broccoli cuts, which I've already cut open. I'm just going to put that on top of the rice. Make it easy. So there's half a package of the frozen broccoli, and then I'm gonna season with the rest of the packet that I didn't use in the rice, just to get, make sure the flavor gets all over my vegetables. And a little bit of cumin. I like cumin in my Spanish flavor dishes. And then I've got some chopped chives. Throw a little bit of that in there, just for a little additional flavor. Then I'm gonna add four cups of water. Actually, I think I'm gonna do three. No, I'm gonna do four, because it is multi-grain rice. And it takes a little more water and a little more time. So there's one. Season the fish again with the same little packet okay, of Spanish seasoning mix. There's one side. I'm gonna put that in and put this over here. And it fits in there perfectly. It's not a very big fish fillet. Put a little more seasoning of the packet there. Oh, a little more of the cumin on my fish. a little bit of salt and then some fresh pepper fresh ground pepper which I'll have to do with two hands and here's what it looks like with the all the seasonings the water the broccoli and here's the fish and I did add a little more of the dried chives to that too for a little additional flavoring and the crushed brown uh, crushed black pepper so we're about to put a cup and I'm gonna use two cups in the bottom since that like I said that's multi-grain rice it'll take a little longer to cook two cups of water in the bottom and put the lid on start it and I'll let you see what it looks like when it's done okay let's see how this has come out Too hot. Let's this off without making a mess. 
Oh, yeah, that was it came out good. Smells really good. Anyway, there's our Mexican flavored rice and fish. It's pretty good for made at work lunch, doesn't it? Let's see what it tastes like. Man, that is good. Those little seasoning packets are just perfect. Man, that's good. And there's the mahi-mahi. Mm. 